Hey there, lovelies and gents. This is your girl, Nadia, a.k.a. The Prophet in Process. And I'm coming back with a part two of Let Him Focus. And this is some additional information that the Lord gave me about this word. Part of what the Lord is telling many of you to do is to focus on yourself so that you can allow him time to heal in the areas he needs to heal in so that he can be the best version of himself, not only for you, but for himself. He needs to be able to get along with not only himself, but with God. So the guy can show him exactly who he is. Because in many of these cases, the reason why he's treated you the way that he's treated you, it's not because there's anything wrong with you. It's because there's so much right with you. And based on what he's experienced before, it doesn't add up. It doesn't make sense. But see, the Lord has to show him how you make sense in his world. And that he is indeed worthy of having you in his life. For many of these gentlemen, they don't believe they're even worthy of it because of their past and because of the way they treated you in some instances. Now, I'm not giving you a go-ahead to be abused by anyone. That's not God's will. Unfortunately, some of us, we can get so worried about this gentleman that we forget about ourselves, we forget about our purpose, we forget about what we're supposed to do. And that's not what God wants you to do. You know, I've said before, you're in your own way because you haven't done what the Lord told you to do. So for some of you, you know what the Lord has told you. You know what the Lord has shown you. And I just want to encourage you. It's going to work out. Just allow him the time to focus on himself for now. And you do the same. I love you lovelies and gents. Have a blessed rest of your day. Until later.